Hey, two believers. Another tutorial from uh, Pete in the house on Ford F-150. All right, so the scenario is I had changed the whole console on my truck because I have an idiot friend. I had the car running, the truck running, right, while the key was in it. He pulls out the key, right? And I'm like looking at him like he's stupid, you know? Like, well, what do you do that for? So I put the key back in, drove him home, you know? Um, shut off the car, the truck, and pretty much when I was trying to start the truck again, what happens? I couldn't turn the key. This lock, the, the mechanism got all messed up inside. Um, so I went ahead and called the boneyard and had him change the whole console. Okay. So what happens? They give me a console with a key. Right. So after I replace the console, everything has a new key. What happens? Because of the chip on the on the key, it wouldn't start. So I had to get it home right away because it was sitting for a whole week waiting on the part. So what did I do? I have a remote start on the truck. I remote start it. After it starts, you put in the key, turn it. It will get you home. It will get you anywhere. So it's been two weeks I've been doing that. So I was re remote start, go to work, whatever. Go grocery shopping, remote remote start, put in the key, turn it, and drive. I said, no, I can't do this anymore, you know. So what I had to think, I said, all right. So the key has a chip in it, right? So what I did, this is the old key from from uh, the old console, right? And this actually is the new one, and it's it says Ford on it. So what I did, um, I opened up the chip which is located right here. It's a little box right here. So you take uh, a razor real careful. Don't get cut like I did. Dumbass. Um, and uh, you pull out the, the chip. The chip, it's located in here. So let me see if I can do this. This is the chip. Okay. So this slides in the, the key, into the key, the butt of the key, in there. Okay. So once you pull uh, pull out the tab, take something like this, you know, and you just pry it out, and it comes right out. It slides right out. Okay. So you you see this part right here right in here you slide right down and it pops right up right out boom so I opened the the new original key and I did the same thing okay um see right there that's when I got cut removing this one um did the same thing pull this out from this one this is the original to this key and um this key, the chip from this key, I replaced it and put it there. And then I sealed it again. Wow. See? So now, instead of using my remote start, I just... Voila! It works! <laughs> Alright. That's a, a little trick. I wasn't going to pay a hundred and... Forty dollars for a new key or whatever um, for the Ford dealer. No, that's not happening. 
All right. Peace.